um, gets almost twice as many excellent reviews as anything else. And it's Outrigger, PP Island Resort and Spa. Not too difficult to get to. Uh, there are land and sea transfers. Um, and it's easily accessible year round uh, via a private boat or a public ferry from Phuket and a public ferry uh, from Krabi. Ferry services is also available from Koh Lanta during the peak tourist season. Um, then allow about three hours travel time uh, from Phuket International Airport to the Outrigger Resort and Spa. And guests really are saying it's uh, heaven on earth. It's a beautiful place, friendly service, uh, absolutely outstanding, um, breathtaking position. Uh, Koh Phi is a beautiful island in the archipelago of um, around uh, not far from Phuket. And this is a real island paradise. Only a few really good resorts on the island and this one uh, tops the list at the moment. Then the little island getaway is on Low Bo Gol Bay, our northeast coast of Koh Phi Phi, gone. And um, 70 tranquil acres, uh, beautiful coconuts, and a half mile of sparkling shore. It's on the website. Then the rooms are little uh, thatched bungalows. Um, four and a half star location, great hospitality. Um, guests can choose a villa with a private swimming pool, free Wi-Fi, beachside suite, superior bungalow, a deluxe garden bungalow, or an outdoor sun deck. And there's beautiful Thai cuisine at this resort and served on the on-site restaurant. Four restaurants, bars, uh, offers a succulent meals as well, beautiful cocktails and uh, great stunning sea, bre sea views and sea breezes as well. Then, yeah, then great place to go. There's a beautiful spa uh, for couples as well. They do the couples things as well. And uh, yeah, you know, you can do your dive tours from here. They can organize your weddings. Uh, yeah, and it's a beautiful resort. And what else do I have to say? I know, I'll give you an idea of the uh, the menu then. Um, noodles and rice dishes, uh, pad thai, uh, mi Phuket, radna, gyong, about 200 baht. Um, beautiful sweets, cinnamon, chocolate mousse, 220 baht. Um, tiramisu, mango custard tart, sticky ginger cake, uh, bakes some more savory dishes like um, baked scallops, fried calamari appetizers, seafood bruschetta. Yeah, and then you go your salads, soups, curry, curries, about four different curries, five different main dishes, pla red prick sod, which is a crispy fried sea bass. Uh, golden fried tiger prawns, grilled tiger prawns, stir fried chicken and cashews, um, wok fried uh, minced chicken, pork, and sauteed seafood in a soy garlic and hot basil leaves. Yeah, and then there's pizzas, warm salads, appetizers, then a pretty good menu. I can see things going up to about 340 baht, 390 baht for uh, um, some some delicious meals and even more Australian prime tenderloin steak grilled lamb chops and a few traditional ones as well as some pastas and things like that looking at the menus talk more about the menus than anything else haven't I but yeah this is a wonderful resort maybe that's maybe the food is what drives the success of this fantastically popular luxury resort that doesn't cost as much as some of the other resorts as well drop in a luxury resort please uh, we'll keep you updated